Another great question we got recently concerning labiaplasty, reduction of the labia minora. And the person wanted to know uh, if this is going to affect their function, their performance, sexual performance. Uh, it's important to keep in mind that the labiaplasty can be done for two different reasons. And again, we're talking about the labia minora plasty. I do all the varieties of the cosmetic gynecologic operations that are available. But when we're talking about the external structures, we're not talking about looseness of the vaginal vault. We're talking about labiaplasty. Uh, specifically, in this case, the internal labia, which is the most common area that people will want reduced. In some cases, there can be a functional need for this. If the labia are very long and they're folding up, then that can cause discomfort and people don't like that. The other and probably more common way for having it, reason for having it done is because of the appearance. Some people just don't like the appearance of the labia minora. That is okay. Um, what I stress for people to keep in mind is that you are almost certainly normal. There is a very wide variety of the shapes uh, and sizes and length and no one is exactly the same. So almost everybody I see is normal. Now, whether it's what you particularly want, that's a different issue. And we can help with that uh, if there uh, is the labia tissue is in excess and there's a couple of different ways to reduce it. I do it all different ways. It's a question of matching the technique to what you are looking to accomplish. Uh, what I would say is that if there's issues of sexual performance or body image that go beyond just the extra tissue, then surgery isn't really a treatment for that per se. And I'd like to see uh, people have those issues kind of sorted out and in their mind that they want to get the surgery for the right reason. In that case, uh, then it can be a very satisfying procedure. Uh, in the right hands, very little uh, chance of issues or complications, usually very little discomfort, uh, and a very satisfying procedure that the majority of patients, uh, at least in my hands uh, in practice, are quite happy with. So again, important to do your research, have some consults, uh, see what you think, and select um, the procedure and the surgeon that you feel is going to be right and give you the results you are looking for.